transition to here. You're a wizard, David. So, <laughs> so we'll transition into Harry Potter with uh, some sports themed Harry Potter. Cool. I'm about it. We're going to build our best Quidditch teams using real life athletes. That's great. So we've got on deck three chasers, a beater, sorry, two beaters, a keeper, and a seeker on our team, correct? Correct. Okay, because I wrote neater, no. and I was like, is that a new position? Neater? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so yeah. So there's not going to be any stipulations as far as choosing the same player, anything like that. Yeah. So. And how do you want to go with it? Um, you just name your lineup, and then I name mine, or one for one? Um, I'd say maybe or name your chasers positions. and I'll name my cha- yeah, name, yeah, yeah, name each of them there and do it like that. Okay. So. Um, well, then I'll start with my three chasers, which so when I was drafting this team, it was kind of like I kind of took literally like what their position is, um, so to speak. So a chaser in my mind is someone who's like super quick and fast. And I could only think of the three fastest people that I think have ever lived. And I went with chaser number one as Usain Bolt. Chaser number two is Carl Lewis. And chaser number three is Jesse Owens. Okay. So I I took a little bit different approach because chasers, they have to be somewhat physical. They have to be like the... I think like the most athletic on the team all around. Oh, I could argue my guys are the most athletic. Maybe. Well, let me see what you got. Go ahead. All right. So with my, for my three chasers, I went with LeBron James, Bo Jackson, and Serena Williams. Oh, interesting. Okay. Not mad at it. Well, I got two beaters for you. No homo. Um, I was going to say, I don't, I don't know how to take that. No homo. Uh, also took these pretty literally. Um, beater number one is going to be Mike Tyson. Um, okay. And beater number two is going to be Kimbo Slice. Okay. RIP. <laughs> I took a, a, a similar approach. Oh, okay. Uh, not, okay. Not, not, not quite as literal, though. Oh, very literal uh, on this side. <laughs> my, for my two beaters, I took J.J. Watt and Shaq. Oh, yeah, I would not want to run into Shaq. <laughs> Just yeah. swinging a club. <laughs> yeah. Also, was did did Kimbo ever like fight professionally? He did. Yeah. Okay. I, yeah. I just remember videos of him like in, like, in the jail backyard, yard and just yeah. knocking out fucking just drunk white rednecks. Yeah. Uh-huh. So, okay. Let's see your keeper. Um again, I had to go with um as literal as possible and for me i'm a soccer fan you're not so you've probably never heard of the man but in my mind the best that i've ever seen at goalkeeper and that is uh mr buffon does he have a first name is that his first uh it's like it's like uh waluigi or something what is it (laughs) waluigi (laughs) it's really close to that actually the little Um, yellow motherfucker it is uh Gianluigi, Jui, Jui. Oh, let me see how you pronounce it. He's do Italian, to, if you couldn't guess. Do we need to bring Andy back on to tell you how to pronounce shit? Da, 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 da. How do you pronounce? Here we go. Um... Google's being Google. Do, 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 do,
We took all that time for you to say John Luigi. <laughs> John John Luigi. It's G I A N Luigi. Hmm. So he is my uh, keeper, Mr. Buffon. Okay. For mine, I went with Deion Sanders. How bizarre! Because at Seeker, starting number twenty-one, I have Deion Sanders. <laughs> Also bizarre, because for my seeker, I went with Usain Bolt. That is really funny. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. Okay. Um, so with my team, I present to you the Harlem Muggle Trotters. So there you go. Hmm. I feel like I need to think of something now. I'll go with, uh, we'll just call him, who the fuck is Quid Bitch? Hmm. Okay. Not. Like, who the fuck is this bitch? Oh, I thought that was a uh, inside joke to that Harry Potter trivia night. What, what was our team name? What was our team name? Something a little racy, if I remember. Like, not like racial, but like... Yeah, racy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I don't remember. Something about... Oh, fuck. Like Dumbledore's balls or something? I don't know. No, it was. I don't think it was that literal. <laughs> it, it was It was punny, metaphorical. Mm. Um, fuck, yeah, I don't remember. I'll have to look that up. Yeah, that was years ago. It was a good one. Yeah. I remember being good. It was but... a good one. We were good ones. All those yeah. fucking nerds there? Mm-hmm. We did pretty good. As we I did really good. In... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think, well, I think we overall went pretty similar routes. I kind of went with Dion at Seeker because, like, I feel like that was his job in the NFL is, like, he was, like, you know, he had to seek out the football and, you know. Yeah, I, I get it. I went more so with his job was to defend, and that's what a keeper does. Well, that's why I went with a goalkeeper. Yeah. Yeah. Not mad at it. And then a be, seeker, I figured you got to be faster than the other guy. And it'd be a very funny, funny match to watch our teams against each other with like Mike Tyson, like, here it comes, I'm going to beat it. And then Shaq's like, oh, no, you're not. I'm going to beat it. <laughs> <laughs> like, it'd be really funny. <laughs> well, I'll have to see if I can find some kind of like AI video generator <laughs> yeah. and see if they can make that happen. Although I think one, two, three of three of my guys aren't alive anymore. So no, two, two. No, I just went as literal as possible. I was like, who are the fastest people? Who are the hardest hitting people? Who's good at keeping stuff out? And then who's good at seeking? I was like, it came pretty quick, actually. Yeah. Like, I didn't have to. It's, it's, you're, you're, <laughs> we got who's good at keeping stuff out? Uh, came pretty quick. Yep. <laughs> I'll just yep. let you keep going. See, <laughs> see how many of these you can, you can roll with. I mean, they're pretty literal positions if you think about it. Like, Ah, like like uh, sixty nine and missionary and uh, no, I don't think sixty nine is very literal. Or if it was, it'd be called like double oral. I don't know. What would you call you a, go? Yeah, sixty eight. That's when you go down on me and I owe you one. <laughs> I mean, that's all I got. <laughs> Thanks, I'm here all week. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> <sighs> and then my team name, I loved it. The Harlem Muggle Trotters. I think it was great. Very clever. Yeah, I got I got patting myself got on the back right now. It's good. Yeah. Um Yeah. I didn't, um, get, I, didn't I didn't get that memo for the team name, so uh, it just kinda came to me, had to do it. Right. Um 